Hello my classy people, TGIF. It is the first weekend of the new year, 2023. Let's give a shout out to DeMar. The young man is doing quite well there in Cincinnati. Got the tubes out of him and uh, has been speaking to the team and stuff. So the power of prayer. So we're so happy for him and, and his family. A uh, 24 year old strong young man. Nicely, nicely done as he continues to recover. Okay, thanks everybody for uh, your comments and pouring out. And of course, as always, subscribe, ring the bell, do those things for, uh, for sure, and turn your closed captions on. And by the way, this is the per first weekend of our all stakes tip sheet that we put out, and we had quite a few uh, purchases uh, on them this weekend. Uh, there's over 10, almost 11 races cutting over five or six tracks. Uh, our first purchaser was Rob. Mr. Rob, thank you, and Sasha. So we really do appreciate your support like that as we continue to work through the format on that new tip sheets. And remember, our old tip sheets are always available for any track. The full card are, is $20 anywhere in North America. And the weekend tip sheets for all the stake races that we believe are viable are $25. That's a lot of work. I didn't realize how much work it was going to be. But thanks, anybody. Hey, oh, thanks, everybody, by the way. Well, you know, I'm going to kind of go quick through this. I do want to post this video at Aquadot for the Jerome States, which is race number eight on the car. It's three-year-olds. Uh-oh, are the babies derby dreaming? Maybe they're going to flat mile for 150000 They fill the eight, and they're all going to have to beat the number six, Arctic Arrogance, right? Arctic uh, arrogance has two wins from four starts in two seconds. So in a small sampling of four starts, this horse has never finished worse than second. Two wins, two seconds. The horse is by Frosted. By the way, our filly by MyRaceHorse.com won today down there at Gulfstream Frosted Oats. So very nicely done. Billy Mott, my racehorse, we got quite a few shares into Frosted Oats. I think she's hitting our breast stride, as most of y'all know as you follow along with us. But anyway, Arctic Arrogance is by Frosted on the back end by Uncle Mo. And here's the thing that gets me. It's Linda Rice and Jose Lascano. I keep telling you, Lascano rides hill, hands and hills for Linda Rice. This horse has Everything this way should sit right behind the speed here, the four and the five, uh, Logan's Knight, and Amanado, a Furious, uh, the number five. So again, the number six horse, Arctic Arrogance, should handle this bunch, will be our top pick for sure. And our second pick will be the number four, right, Logan Knight. Well, this one is uh, only three starts, one first, one second, and one third. I think this horse has a big upside. Mike McCarthy doing all the training. The horse is by Golden Sense. Got a very nice rating on the dirt and on the turf. Uh, Dylan Davis is doing the calls here. The horse comes out of an allowance race on November 26th. Back in 42 days, I think it should make a nice appearance. Now, I don't think it could beat the number six horse, but weirder things have happened. This will be our second pick, Logan Knight, for sure. Now, I was kind of torn between um, the number five horse, who's very strong here, Am, 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 and the motto, A Furies is this uh, number five for six to one, which is a square, square price. But there's a lot of speed in this race. So I really would like for someone to come from downtown here to try to pick up the pieces and the tries and the exactas. So we'll go ahead and use uh, the number eight horse, Narcissus Del uh, Dally, uh, at 20 to one. But we just don't think nobody can beat the six here. We like six, four, just like that in this order with eight five just like that so in this year jerome um i don't know if any derby winners have come out of here but they are three-year-olds and horses get better as they move along so let's see what happens i think the number six horse is another lead pipe cinch just like in the ninth race in the um stake race there at aqueduct i don't think nobody could be law professor the number seven horse so eighth race it's all about the number six horse for us we believe the horse Arctic uh, Arrogance should win. We'll put them over the four, eight, five, just like that. 
and we'll call it a day and go watch some NFL football for sure. Stay classy. As always, remember every weekend we're doing an all-stakes tip sheet for $25. This was the first weekend. We had a nice little pouring out. We're still working out what format we're using, either Word or uh, Word document or Excel, which I hate Excel, by the way. And I do all this stuff personally. I don't let nobody else do this stuff. I do all the handicapping, and I put and I constructed the sheets. A lot of work was put into this this weekend, and a lot of calls from people. But I love doing it. I'm home anyway, uh, here in the studio. So please email me at speaking24 at Yahoo. Dot com, or you can get us on the Speed King number, which is 732-804-0637. Text us. We'll get back to you. Please support us any which way you can as we start the new year out, for sure. All stakes. Tip sheets. Every weekend. We cut across seven tracks. I love that. You just look and play the stake races, right? Speed King style. What do we like? Anyway, we have a bunch of fun, and thanks so much, um... For your support. Passion of love for sure. Stay classy. Enjoy your weekend. Again, another shout out to that young man in Cincinnati. Uh, Mr. Hamlin. Uh, uh, DeMar uh, is doing real well. And we couldn't be more happier. That is what's important. Okay. Aside from what we do for entertainment. That's somebody's child. Right. I have mine and my grandchildren. And it does put things in perspective. So we're very, very happy for his recovery. And I know he'll just get... Uh, stronger and um, let's continue to pray for his his well-being and uh, the best of health to him for sure okay Ar uh, Arctic arrogant race number eight beautiful aqueduct on Saturday stay classy y'all enjoy this weekend bunch of football coming up and then the following weekend we'll do playoffs wow it doesn't get any better than this and we got horse racing what else is new as we move towards the derby stay classy y'all